Remember to take your receipt. The move off. I'm home and I have a candy thermometer, vanilla extract, food coloring, toothpicks, more grapes to try, some nerds. Very sad first attempt. I don't know why I'm so dead set on making these candied grapes. I've just really wanted to try to make them. I'm not gonna film everything I'm doing. I'm going to just show you the end result, if it worked or if it didn't work. Okay, better than last time. I do think that I could still do better. So, yeah. Should we try it? I'm dropping nerds everywhere. I don't think I'm going to be doing this again. So you can see like the really dark ones are burnt. I burnt the candy and then the lighter colored ones, they did turn out, but I feel like the grapes are gigantic. So you know what? I will not be bringing these to Christmas Eve, but it was fun. It was a fun little, little project. They are really good, except for the burnt ones. The burnt ones are not good. You can tell which ones are burnt because they're darker in color. Um, yeah, candied grapes, did it. Dinner's ready, that's all I wanted to say. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I bought so much ribbon for the Christmas tree and I like, I used like maybe a quarter of it, not even. Um, so I'm gonna return the ribbon that I didn't use. I just made it to Hobby Lobby. Wish me luck because this is gonna be kind of cringy returning all that ribbon. I feel like they're gonna have to like match each skew to the line on the receipt. I don't know, maybe it'll be super quick and easy. I feel really bad. I should have gone in with a plan last time. Like, I didn't have a plan. I just went in and bought like more ribbon than I needed. Been out and about for quite a while like trying to find Christmas presents. I was looking for stocking stuffers and I do a stocking for Finley, my dog. This little best friend necklace. I'm gonna give this to Finley for Christmas and attach one of the little charms to his collar and then I'll wear the other one. I thought it was a cute idea. This is your sign to get a best friend necklace with your dog.
Ben. I've got a sweater on him. Yeah? You gonna walk? So it's Christmas Eve Eve, so it's the 23rd and Finn and I are gonna go for a walk after my car thaws out because it's frozen. Deep cleaned the bathroom and just got everything really tidy and I'm also working on getting my laundry done. <sighs> I hate laundry. I really hate cleaning too, but it's just one of those things you have to do. I just realized my hat is the same color as Jordan's truck. <laughs> uh, I do like this blue color. I got this at Target. That's one of my goals for the new year is to not go to Target so much. It's just like, when I'm bored, I go to Target and I just need to not do that. Like, there's nothing there that I need. I really wanted to do like a no buy here. I don't know, we're gonna see. I just wanna save a little bit more. I don't need to have so much stuff, you know? Anyways, I think I'm gonna do a video. I mean, when we get back to like regular scheduled content. Um, I'm gonna do a video about like planning for the new year, getting back on track, um, and maybe go over my goals. Like I had goals from 2022, 2023, and I kind of reviewed them side by side, just like personal goals. Just wanna go back and look at the goals that I wrote for 2023, kind of reflect on what I was able to do and what I would, might still need well, there's lots of areas that I still need to work on. <laughs> I just want to go back and kind of like um, review what I actually accomplished and what I don't really feel like I want to do anymore because that's fine. Like goals change. It was a year of personal growth. I had a year with ups and downs, but overall I had a lot of fun things that I got to experience. Um, and yeah, I guess. I don't know. I guess that's where I'm at. <laughs>